quick uh, thing to show you uh, how to test the trolling motor out, out of the water at home or um, or um, if you want to buy a use the trolling motor this is how you uh, do it you connect the red uh, wire from um, the trolling motor which is this one to the positive of the battery it can be a car battery as well and the negative of which is a black wire to the negative and then um, red wire to the positive of the battery negative wire to the uh, negative of the battery and uh, as you can see I have this uh, uh, it's really a car charger um, or starting cable um, that I uh, extended from the original wire of the trolling motor of the Minn Kota 30. So this is the Minn Kota 30 in the back. You can see over there. And then uh, right now it's on. You turn here to one. And then you can see, and also here, the blade is spinning in the back down there. You know, and then second gear, third gear, second gear, and off. One, two, three. That's reverse. I'm doing the reverse right now. That's why it's only three gears. Two, one, off. One, two, three, four, five. So five gears for this uh, main Koda 30 pounds push trolling motor. Four, three, two, one, off. So you can connect to the um, car battery. Car battery is the 12 volts too, so you can connect to the car battery. Now I have, uh, I also have this one, uh, which is a motor guy, which is a hand control. And um, as you can see, the this one, the power is, um, is um, this motor guy uh, power is like this. You know, but uh, if you want to test that, it's very simple. Just open this, open this top cover, find the red wire and the black wire, and then connect to the battery. And then you can, um, once it's connected, the prop will start turning. You know, same thing with this wireless, uh, wireless motor, same thing. You know, you can see this wire is like this. Um, this the plug is like this. But, um, you can easily open this up. I'll show you in a second. Wireless trolling motor, the white one down there. And